Okay, 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 okay. This is Norris again, and um, so let me answer your second question. What's the difference between a eco village and you know like a normal town? Well, first thing is um, it's not really a village. I mean, it's not of that size. It's um, it's pretty small. It's only about um, right here and now in the winter or um, just beginning spring. It's about um, fifteen people living here and you know guests come through but actually they make most of their money through residents um, rather than guests and programs but really my life here is pretty normal I live in a normal apartment I'll, I'll walk around with the camera and show you that in a minute and um, you know most of the time I I, uh, I mean during my free time I pretty much do what I normally do I go on, on online um, I read, you know, I take walks, um, you know, just totally normal behavior. I don't do anything different here than I would elsewhere, but there are certain advantages to being here. Um, one, it's kind of like a college, although without as much diversity in that um, I can walk from my apartment downstairs to the uh, community center, which is like a lobby, uh, without going outside, which is great in the winter time. And, um, oh wow. Well, listen, I'm gonna cut this short because my roommate's buddy, uh, he's, he's uh, having this guy stay here for a couple weeks. So I wanna go introduce myself and meet this guy because uh, my roommate was describing, he sounds pretty cool. And, uh, you know, I wanna be polite, uh, good roommate. But, um, so I will get back to you on that bagel. Just be patient. I mean, for you, I'm going to upload these all at once, so you don't even have to be patient. You're going to get it all at once, which is another thing about the internet, which is both amazing and kind of spoils us as well, that instant gratification. But anyway, I'll be back.